Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. So today I have a video on the new drip feed animal added to Reddit Online as part of the Naturalist update. And today we have the Shadow Buck and you would just basically go up to Harriet and you should have this mission as your first one. After you complete it, it may appear again after 48 minutes, but if it doesn't then it'll probably appear the third time. So let's do it here and in this video we're going to both skin and sedate the animal. Okay, so this mission is a very easy. All you basically have to do is go over the sighting location, and if you don't have any sedative rounds like me, I was stupid and I forgot to um, get sedative rounds before I start the mission, there will be sedative rounds spawning, so you can pick up a box of 20, they will pop up as a little notification on your map. But here's the thing, if you go near the sighting location and then you go looking for the ammo, the sighting location is going to disappear, and what I did was I ran around the area trying to find it. It's this area right up here above the the cliffs when you get right up here it's always this area your map will then turn yellow you have this little yellow blob here and all you basically got to do is you got to go over and investigate this deer carcass here once you investigate this deer carcass you will have a path just follow that path and when you follow that path you will get near the waterfall you have a single poacher here just kill him and uh, at this point what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to dismiss your horse because basically you're going to run around the waterfall on foot you can't really take your horse on this side and uh, then when you try to call your horse your horse is going to be on the other side of the waterfall so just dismiss your horse here run around and then once you run around you just keep following the path now once you get near this house um, shack up here you have a bunch of poachers that will try to kill you um, you can just ignore them or kill them but once you get past them, then you will start hearing the animal sound. You keep going. Once you get over to this area right here where the meteor is. Where the meteor hits, this is where the deer will spawn and this cutscene will play. At this point after the cutscene, it's just really easy. All you have to do is you just have to either sedate or kill a legendary shadow buck. And if you're looking to take a photograph, you just take it right here. Don't get any closer because then it'll run away. It stands here for a little bit, take the photo, and then go after it. And it's really easy to take down the legendary shadow buck because it'll run down the same path down this hill and it starts going very slowly. And you can use the elephant gun if you want to kill it quickly. Remember, the elephant gun does not ruin the pelts for legendary animals. So you just shoot it, does a a lot of damage, take it down pretty quickly. Same thing for the sedative round. Sedative is really easy. Going down this hill here, sedate it, and then take the sample. Now also, can you skip that part with uh, the waterfall? I tried to skip that part with the waterfall, but the area where the meteor hits, the area where that big crater is, it where the shadow buck spawns, that area was grayed out, so I wasn't able to access that area until the shadow buck pops up on my map. I have that little yellow question mark disappears and appears a few seconds later. Once you see that yellow question mark, that's the point when you can actually go to the crater area and find the legendary shadow buck. So right here, we just sell the sample to Harriet. Uh, and then after that, we just take the pelt and we sell it to Gus. And again, remember, if you want to craft the legendary shadow buck coat, then you need to for kill the animal, skin it, and you need to bring the pelt and sell it to Gus. And and when you sell the pelt to Gus, it's $45. And then in order to buy the legendary shadow coat, you need to spend $705 on it. It's a pretty expensive outfit, but it's personally my favorite one. I just like the antlers on top, but that's just me. Overall, I think that this is the easiest legendary um, animal that's been added so far. Very, very easy. The only annoying part was kind of running around that waterfall. But other than that, it's just extremely easy. I think it's even easier than the uh, legendary banded gator because even though legendary banded gator, that mission was kind of quicker. Uh, you had other alligators that would attack you here. You know, you can have some cougars and other animals that are around the area, but there's nothing specifically protecting the deer. So thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like. And if you're new to my channel, enjoy my content, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, everyone.